I'm Alec Ritchie, I'm from the Rotary Club of Abbeydale, which is one of the eight participant clubs who run music in the gardens every year here in the Sheffield Botanical Gardens. We've done this now for 10 years and uh, we raise a lot of money for local and national charities. The rain is everywhere but it's great it's about 23 degrees and it's fantastic and there's about 2,000 people, maybe more, that's come through the doors and the atmosphere is amazing. Ben Parkinson on the front handing out leaflets for the Rotary Club. Tonight being the first night we've got the local singer Paul Carrick and uh, he's got a great support as you can imagine being a local Sheffield lad. Tomorrow night we've got Linda's Farm, the old folk group, we're looking forward to them. I'm really looking forward to seeing the Proclaimers who are coming here on Saturday night, which is a sellout. We always traditionally end with a brass band, well we're in Yorkshire, a Philharmonic Orchestra and a firework display which is on Sunday night. We do hope However, that Friday, Saturday, Sunday, the weather will be better than it's been tonight. When you consider that we've had this incredible July day yesterday, the 1st of July, and I got here at 3 this afternoon, it was lovely, a beautiful afternoon, and look at it now. But the rain's off, and the folk are out there, they're enjoying themselves, they've got their umbrellas up admittedly, and they've got their cagoules on, but they're in for a good night, and uh, let's hope we're in for a good four days. Paul Carrick. We just finished our set at the Botanical Gardens in Sheffield and it was great. The audience were absolutely fantastic and even though they got soaked wet through before we went on they were absolutely amazing so we had a great time. On. I'm Rod Clements, a founder member of the band. We're headlining tonight, Friday night, at Music in the Gardens. It's just a lovely atmosphere. I mean, the Botanical Gardens is a fantastic environment. Anyway, I know it well. I've been coming here off and on for, for years. The first hit record we had was Meet Me on the Corner in 1971, but we're also, I suppose, best known for some Alan Hull songs, like Fog on the Tyne, Lady Eleanor, run for home. We're due on in about 10 minutes and uh, I'm really look looking forward to playing. It looks like a great audience. Everybody looks up for it and, and we certainly are. Yeah, definitely. We're very excited. It's going to be a great night. I'm Steve Bailey. I present the early show at BBC Radio Sheffield and tonight I'm lucky enough to be hosting the, the gig. The sun's come out. They were a bit cloudy earlier on, but the sun's come out. Uh, blue skies, people are drinking the beer, uh, enjoying the wine and, and a great atmosphere. Yeah, the band's doing great as well. Well, we've just finished playing to the lovely audience in the Botanical great. Gardens and there was such a great crowd, they were obviously well up for it. Started off with a few people down at the front and by the end we had a big crowd down at the front. I think it's a brilliant event organised by great, dedicated people and they do such good work and raise such a lot of money for charity. And, you know, it's just a, a great uh, testament to the city of Sheffield. Everyone's having the time of their lives, they're eating their beef burgers and they're drinking their bottles of champagne and just having a wonderful night and we're so thrilled. I'm representing uh, Crohn's and Colitis UK. It's a charity that my wife is very much a big part of because she's a colitis sufferer so we're representing them and helping out. My name is Andy Brewer I'm the chairman of the Sheffield Group of Diabetes UK and we're here in the Botanical Gardens tonight in Sheffield for Music in the Gardens. I think we're going to raise a lot of money tonight hopefully and I think that everybody's been really generous so far and with that money we'll be able to put on a lot of events in Sheffield that will really help people with diabetes come together. Tonight we've got the Proclaimers uh, and we've got the Julian Jones Bands in support. 
and we've sold out. We sold out about three weeks ago, so we've got over 3,100 in, which is a record for the event. My name's Toby Foster, I do the breakfast show on BBC Radio Sheffield, I run the Last Laugh Comedy Club. We're blessed with the weather again, I don't know how they get away with it, but there's nearly 3,000 people in there, all up for a good time. This is a, a huge stage in the middle of a park, and, and they do it as professionally as any festival I've played. I've played Leeds, Reading, I've been to Glastonbury, this is as professional a do as I've ever played. I'm Craig, I'm Charlie, we are the Proclaimers and we've been playing here tonight in the Botanical Gardens at Sheffield. Thankfully the weather was very good, um, the crowd were fantastic um, and really it's a few years since we've played Sheffield, it's always been great playing here, we've played many times down the years but this is the first time in, in a place like this so really enjoyed it. My name is Maggie Clark and I'm Mayor of Rotherham. Tonight it's the Sheffield Philharmonic and the Unite Brass Band that are playing. I'm Andy Crane, I present Sunday Breakfast on BBC Radio Sheffield and I'm the host for the last night of Music in the Gardens this year. It's a tremendous night, once again we've got Unite the Union Brass Band, we've got the Sheffield Philharmonic, they will play Jerusalem, they will play Rural Britannia, the audience will jump up and down, they will wave Union flags, there will be fireworks at the end, it is between you and me the best night of music in the gardens. My name is uh, Councillor Talibus and uh, I'm Lord Mayor of Sheffield. I'm here in Botanical Garden. I think uh, these kind of uh, events bring the business in Sheffield. Uh, it's really good for Sheffield, uh, bringing the community together and enjoying this weather uh, and the music. Yeah. 